Okay, so sorry about the audio being a little bit messed up on the, uh, at the start of the video. Um, Audacity, just being weird. Audacity, just being weird. I'm gonna start a new booklet. I'm gonna start a new booklet for this. Okay. I actually don't have a name that I would normally name this. Um, let's name you Dread. Dread the Zerua. So you've decided on the nickname Dread. Yes. Okay, my partner is Froki. Wow, we go together great. The two of us are just way, way, way too cute. Nice to meet you, Finnegan. I'm Serena. Because of you, I can be a real Pokemon trainer. Thank you. Uh, pardon me, but I have something from for you from the professor as well. I have something that will help you understand Pokemon on a much deeper level. Alright, so we get the Pokedex. We get the uh, Pokedex. Um, so you see, the Pokedex I just gave you is a high-tech device that automatically records the Pokemon you encounter. The reason you get one is because the professor wants to go on a journey with our Pokemon and complete the Pokedex. To put it in another way, it's an important mission from the professor, I'm sure of it. Oh, lighten up, Trevs. You're way too serious sometimes. Um, Fox, please take this with you. It's a letter from the professor. He said you should give it to your mom. And Trevor just looks so fucked. Or, uh... Oh, I don't even remember what his name is. Alright, we're done with our errand for the professor. I guess Trevs and I will go look for Pokemon. Let's go, Trevs. In Kalos, kids are chosen to carry a Pokedex and go on an adventure. But you need to go give that letter to your mom before you go. Okay, so we do we do actually need to heal first. Or not heal. Um, We do actually need to... Um, save up right here. I'm going to do a really quick cut because we actually need to add the, uh, wait, did that actually save? Yeah, it did. Okay. Uh, we need to go add, um, yeah, we need to go add, uh, flame orbs to our, to our little, uh, thing, our game. There we go. Okay. Okay, so we are back. We have the flame orbs. And now Dread is holding the first of them. Okay. This is gonna be a really tough series, guys. Oh, here's Serena. Fox, wait! You're gonna be my opponent in the Pokemon Battling debut! Okay, little Froakie. It's our first battle. Let's win it with style. Uh, which one did she get? Uh, cause this could be scary. This could be actually scary. So she got a Skaroopy. Uh, so her Pokemon was randomized completely as well. Uh, that's, that's actually good. That's actually good because Xerneas or, um, what was the other? I, I don't even remember now. Either or would have been pretty, uh, difficult to take on right now. That's for sure. Alright, let's lower his defense. Uh, do... Do not poison me. Oh! She got the poison on us. That's really unfortunate. Because uh, we would have been burnt anyways. This battle, we're probably going to lose this battle. Uh, I don't see any way that we win this. We did luckily... We did luckily... Not, um... Oh my gosh, we're not doing anything to this thing. But luckily, we weren't burned. So there's that. Alright, if this hits me again, I'm gonna die. Uh, so let's just go for the pursuit. It's it's stab. Oh wow, he actually went for the knockoff. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we got destroyed. <laughs> oh my gosh, Serena. She destroyed this. Pretty good, right, Fox? Here, let me fix up your Pokemon. Say hi to your mom for me. Oh, that's Shauna, not Serena. Whoops. Uh, so hopefully, hopefully our first battle with Serena goes a lot better than that. Because holy cow. Say hi to your mom for me.
So, what did you and the neighbor kids end up doing? Wait one second, Fox. Is that a Pokeball you have there? You got your very own Pokemon? Lucky you! How about that? You're a Pokemon trainer now. Congratulations! Huh? A letter from me? It says it's from somebody named Sycamore. What could it be? A love letter? A love letter? Wow, what lovely handwriting. Hmm, what do we have here? A request? Oh, I see. Fox, you're barely unpacked and all kinds of exciting things are happening. Okay, let's get you and Chespin. Chespin, ready to go. Zerua! Not Chespin. Come on, Mom. Uh, they're probably gonna call that... Or they're probably gonna name it incorrectly the entire game. What an expect unexpected turn of events! It's like just like a sudden last burst of speed from a racer on a Raihorn race. You made friends, you met your Pokemon, and now you get to take a lap around Kalos. Oh, and don't forget this. Ah, uh, yes, we do need a map. You know how to use the town map, right? Yes. That's my boy. Select the town map for your bag whenever you want to use it. We just said we know how to use it. I don't know what this this Professor Sycamore wants you to see on your trip, but taking a journey with your Pokemon is a really wonderful experience. All right, now we got we got Rhyhorn. We got to say goodbye to Rhyhorn. Ha ha ha! What a card! I guess Rhyhorn just wanted to give you a big send off for your journey. Well, it has known you since you were born, after all. Good luck, Fox. Go for broke, and don't worry. You'll have your Pokemon by your side, so you'll be fine. She is surprisingly calm for someone letting their kid just, like, leave forever, basically. Alright, we really need to get these, uh, skates. Um, which one is the... Okay, here's the potions. We will not buy Pokeballs in here. We will buy potions, though. Okay, so they only sell potions in here anyways. Uh, let's get... Let's get seven of them. We're gonna need them. We're really, really gonna need them. Okay, now we're gonna go to the first route. Wait, what's this? Oh, that's a Pokeball shop. Okay. So we, we got the potion shop and the Pokeball shop. Hey, Pokemon trainer. Okay. I think someone shows us how someone shows us how to find a Pokemon, right? Yeah, we don't have Pokeballs in, yet anyways. Uh, but this counter is always a... Honchkrow. <laughs> we haven't been given Pokeballs yet, so... Uh, what's really unfortunate, this is really unfortunate, Zerua looks like um, he has all physical type attacks early on. So this is going to be, like, that does nothing. Oh my gosh. We might we might actually lose uh, to this Honchkrow. Oh my gosh. Uh, we need to leer up. We need to leer it. This is why I wanted the Xerneas, because the Xerneas would be a special attacker. But no. We gotta go for the Zerua. It's got all physical type attacks. During a bird lock. Oh my god, there's no way. Uh, if that thing is in the is in the grass here, we, we just have to run from it every single time. <laughs> Can we get a crit here? No, we can't. Okay, it's okay. We do we do die, but oh actually we survived. Survived on one, but then the burn. Okay, so we're gonna we're, we get knocked out. That's okay. Um, oh, we dropped forty dollars. Yeah, I don't want to be doing that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh no, we had to go all the way back here. Okay, yeah. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. Okay, mom. Holy cow. I, I, I could have potioned up there, but I want to save our potions for um, whatever the... Uh, I don't remember what the... Uh, what this little for forest is. I don't remember what it's called. Um, but we do we do need to get past this patch of grass. Um, 
Hopefully he doesn't make me fight the Honchkrow again. Oh yeah, do we have to beat this thing? Is that the only way we get past this? Uh, cause I don't think we can beat it. Are we just hard locked into right here? <laughs> okay, so let's scratch first. Yeah, oh my gosh, this does nothing. Uh, we're just gonna have to waste all of our potions then, I guess. Although if it goes for one wi one wing attack, just basically wrecks us. Yeah, let's uh, let's let's uh, kind of weaken it a little bit. Ah, wing attack! Oh my god, a crit! Okay, so we died again. There's nothing we can do against this Hodgecrow. There's literally nothing we can do against this Hodgecrow. Potions right there. We need to catch a Rotata with guts. Did we grow a level? Thank goodness. Thank goodness we grew a level. Okay, now we need to go back. Because holy crap. Uh, I might need to, like, grind up right here. I'll make this first episode a little bit longer, because we because we have to deal with this. Ah, uh, this is episode two technically. First episode was the uh, choose our starter, but this first actual action we might have to uh, make it a little longer. Okay, what else can we run into here? Because we won't get we won't get a potion or we won't get. Uh, Pokeballs. That actually would be... This should be actually decent to uh, fight. Because Pursuit is going to be super effective. So I don't know if I can beat anything. Oh, wow. That was a crit. This might be the only thing I can beat in this route, though. <laughs> And it's going to do a lot. Okay, so we have to make sure... We have to make sure we're healing up. Uh, I might want to get one more level before I move on. Because, yeah, that... Here, I don't know... Uh, we'll, we'll just go heal. We'll just go heal. Yeah, the, the burn on, on, on this thing is really hurting us. If we can get, like, Dark, dark Pulse or something like that, then it'll be a little bit better. Uh, but not being able to use a special type attack right now is... Definitely, definitely hurting us. That's why I really, really, really wanted the Xerneas, but no! It's okay. I'm happy with the Zerua as well. And there's a Zorark in Route 1. <laughs> or Route 2. I don't think I can beat this thing, though. <laughs> There's no way. How much do I do to it with, with just Scratch without the burn? Oh, we're doing about half. Okay. Oh, no, but it's setting up on me. All right, let's see if we can beat it. 
Because this should be some pretty good XP. Should do about half. What is this going to do? Oh, that didn't do anything. Okay. We should be able to beat this thing. It's only a level 2. So it's only a level 2 Zorak. That'll do nothing. Uh, hopefully this grows us one more level. We really, really would like that. Uh, it doesn't appear to be any Rotatas in this in this route. Uh, we really need we really need another savior on our squad, especially now that we've got the uh, burns. I could do it with my champ as well, or even just a fire type. Fire types uh, in this are really crucial, really crucial. The last time I did a burn lock, I did not find a single fire type though. Like, no, I, I take that back. Uh, I found a fire type. Um, I think right after the 8th gym, and it was a Heatran. I did catch it, uh, but then of course my, uh, my computer crashed and we lost all of the, uh, the data. But it took that long in Pokemon Diamond to find a fire type. Oh wow, there's so many dark types here. Also, basically none of this I think I can catch. Oh yeah, I'm dead. Okay, so if we run into that, we have to run away right away. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so there's as well as with with Dragon Rage. Oh my gosh, we are faster. Wait, why did it take me all the way here? I healed up at the Pokemon Center, or the little heal station. Okay, we get it, Mother. We get it, Mom. Okay. I really do need to get one more level. Really do need to get one more level. If we're a level eight, I feel a lot more comfortable. Okay, okay. If we run into Azuelas though, we have to just run away right away. Oh, there's a Tepig in here too. Oh my gosh, if we can get the catch a Tepig. That would be peak. That would be absolutely the best thing we could catch in this. In this, uh, Because it's a fire type. It's a Tepig. It's a fire type. I love how everything else in this route is so much easier than that Honchkrow. Like, our guaranteed encounter was the hardest thing we could have run into. Alright, this should be a level. We really need to we really need to run into that Tepig. Really, really, really need to run into that Tepig. Fortunately we don't get another attack another attack. Um, but we should we should be okay at level eight. I'm assuming. I'm assuming we're okay at level eight. Oh, whoa, whoa, I thought the game was going to lag, or going to lock up. Uh, I'm actually probably going to save really fast here. Okay. Okay. We also do have, um, we should, I, I don't know when we're going to start it, uh, but we do, uh, we have a couple collaborations. Um... Mm -hmm. We have a tag lock of platinum per coming up soon. Come learn how to catch Pokemon with me. Serena's mom and dad are amazing trainers. That's why she knows so much about catching Pokemon and battling. Mm -hmm. Well, mom and dad may be good, but that has nothing to do with me. Okay, now watch carefully, you two. Uh, but yeah, we've got a, a platinum tag lock with the uh, folks over at the Pokeduber Discord. And then uh, we may have a soul link coming with our buddy uh, Bryce. Um, so you guys will want to make sure you're ready for that. Although I don't know when that one's coming. I actually don't know when either is coming. Because uh, the plot, the tag lock, I'm, I'm basically at the last person. So if they lose before um, they get to me, then obviously, obviously. Well, she's got 50 Pokeballs. How she got this much money? So not fair. How she got so much money?
yeah so I'm, I'm one of the last people on the on the tag block um but that's okay wow the pokemon went inside the pokeball shauna what do you think your po your frokery isn't what do you think your frokey is inside of right now here i'll share your pokeballs with you shauna is fucking stupid she's so fucking stupid oh my gosh pokeballs do you think i can catch pokemon with them too Sure, you can catch Pokemon around here. Just spike the wrong Pokeball near them. Okay, if I find a cute Pokemon, I'll throw lots of Pokeballs at it, and then we'll become friends. When you catch a wild Pokemon, it makes your Pokemon stronger too. Good luck. Okay. This is our first encounter. The first encounter of the Burnlock is unfortunately a Togepi. No! Oh no! That's about the worst thing we could have run into. Where was this when I was trying to like level up my level dread up? Uh, yes, we do want to give it a name. We're gonna name her. We're gonna name him Scrambled. We're gonna put him in the in the in the uh, party for now, but he's probably gonna be some uh, some fodder if we need it. I am really sad. I'm really sad. Of all the things we could have run into, we run into a Tokapi. We're gonna heal up before we face this trainer. Uh, it, to preface this, we're going to be healing up a lot. Uh, it's going to be a lot of back and forth. Because uh, we just can't risk it. We can't risk... Um, can't risk it right now, especially. We don't have any special type attacks. And uh, we don't really have a lot of potions. So going back and forth is really our best option at the moment. We do have to face youngster Joey, a boy youngster Joseph. Oh, youngster Austin. I, I lied. Apparently this isn't youngster Joey. He's got the fur fro. He's got the girl kind of fur fro. The pretty with the uh, pink and the, uh, yeah. Why is... Wait, what? Why... Uh Oh my gosh, that does so much. Oh, okay, illusion. I was so confused. I was like, what the crap is going on? Uh I think we lost though. Uh and it's lowering our attack even more. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Dude. Youngster Austin. What is your problem, bro? I'm already burned. Oh my... Oh, I never put the uh, flame warp on the... Unscrambled yet. That's okay. Son, that's an unfortunate mistake. Uh, I think I just lose this thing, though. To be totally honest with you. Because Zerua cannot take this thing out. I don't think. Uh, please don't go for an attack here. Oh my gosh, it just keeps using sand attack, though. Yep, 
Yeah, we have five potions left because of that haunch crow. And it just keeps using growl. Man, come on. So we have to literally sit here and stall it and leer, but it keeps growling me. My my offense could not possibly be any lower for a fro. I don't even know if this thing has an attack. Other than like sand attack. It might just have sand attack and growl. Did we miss again? It doesn't help that we're missing as well. I have to lower this thing's defense as much as we can. As it's using sand attack. Okay, we're gonna heal up, we're gonna heal up on um, Dread. It does have tackle, okay. It does a lot to Scrambled. So Scrambled gets hit one more time with the tackle and, he, and Scrambled is gone. Scrambled will be a Scrambled. Stop using growl and Oh my gosh, I would rather this thing attack me because I can't do anything to it. Oh my gosh, it's just spamming. There's the tackle. Tackle doesn't really do anything, but it keeps spamming sand attack and growl. It's so annoying. <clears throat> Can you stop? Can you stop going for, for growl? Like legit. Like for real. Uh, I've got to go into uh, Scrambled, and Scrambled's probably going to die here. I don't see a world where Scrambled lives right now. Spamming the sand attack and growl. Like, why? Why is this a thing? Gotta heal up Dread. Goes for another growl, though. I would rather it go for a tackle right here. Even though Dread would get hurt. Can you not? Can you not sand attack me? What does this do? Oh my gosh, it does so much. We actually got a crit. We actually got a crit. We actually got a crit. Oh my gosh, and now it's just go. Please kill. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, if we didn't kill right there, we'd lost Dread, and we lost the lock. There was no way. Well, yeah, Scrambled, there was no way he was uh, Scrambled. Oh my gosh, fake tears. When does Scrambled get something that is useful to us? Alright, scr Scrambled learned. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I'm okay. Okay, we should be able to we will outspeed this thing. The illusion <laughs> threw me off so bad. The illusion threw me off so much. I was like, what the heck? What the heck is going on with this game? I forgot that Zerua had illusion.
Okay, I was I was starting to think that maybe our uh, recording had become lost or something. <laughs> oh wow, there's a heal. I got the worst encounter in this grass. I literally got the worst thing I could get with this Togepi. Uh, Togepi needs to evolve like fast. We could have had the mascot! We could have gotten a Delphox, the, the channel mascot. This is the first game I've played. Uh, actually, second, because we could have gotten it in Moon Emerald. Literally the second game I've played that we could actually get the mascot on our team. Oh, god dang it. Shauna's gonna follow us the entire, entire time. Uh... I am probably, I do need to be on a call for work really fast here. So we're going to try to catch a Pokemon really quickly. And it's a Ponyta! I do need to grab something. Okay, so we're going to try, we're going to try really hard to catch this thing. Uh, I'm going to fake tears it. For once, I actually want to be burnt. That's okay. That's okay because we're level nine right now, and I don't want to kill this thing. Uh, this pony's out would be so hyped to have. All right, so we should hardly do anything. To yes, we hardly do anything to this thing. This is the best ever. The one time that I'm happy to be burnt. Please don't crit. <gasps> oh my god! Like that! Zerua! Dread! What are you doing? Okay. Let's go for the Pokeball. Can't we catch the Ponyta? Because this would be honestly amazing to have a fire type this early in the game, especially a Ponyta. We do get it. We do get it. Yes, we're gonna name we're gonna name him Stallion. Stallion the Ponyta. Okay, so unfortunately, I do have to I do have to to uh, end this off really quickly because I've got to be on a work call literally right now. Uh, but I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, Fox out.